Hey guys, it's Crystal from Strength in You, your fitness and therapy experts. Welcome back to my reflexology series. Today we're gonna to be talking about what's located on the bottom of the foot. So first we begin with this section right here. So on this part is where your lung reflex is located, your lung and chest, and then this part is where your heart reflex is located. This part is a good place to work on for anyone that has cardiovascular issues or problems with breathing such as asthma. The next part we can work on is this right here, which is your solar plexus and then your diaphragm reflex. This is important to work on for anyone who has trouble with relaxing or deep breathing. Um, generally speaking, when you have anxiety, you have take very shallow breaths. And so working on the diaphragm area will allow the patient to breathe deeper and have more calm. This part over here is your liver reflex, which is important for detoxifying the blood and also getting rid of old blood cells. This part over here is your stomach reflex, which is worked on for anything to do with digestion issues and things like that. So along the waistline, you have the kidneys. The kidneys are believed to be the seat of the body's energy. And also just above the kidneys, you have your ad adrenal cortex, which is controlling your body's stress hormone cortisol. So below here, we have our colon, our intestines. So starting over here is the ileocecal valve which is the body's mucus center. So we travel up the ascending colon and then across the transverse colon. And then we go to the other foot because as I said before, the body is divided into two parts. And of course the colon is on both the right and the left side. So we travel across the ascending colon up into the splenic curve and then down the sigmoid colon and then we end it here. So as I said, the kidneys are in this part, and then we can travel down the ureters, which connect to the bladder, which is located on the inner side of the foot. The last bit I wanna talk about is the small intestine. So if this is the large intestine here, the small intestine covers anything in between here. As I mentioned before, the body is mapped anatomically onto the feet. So organs which are more on the left side of the body, such as the heart, will have a bigger reflex than on, on the left foot than on the right foot. Similarly, things like the gallbladder, which is located under the liver, will only be found on the right foot. At the end of the day, reflexology is used to decrease blockages from the zones in the foot to the areas like the organs. But I'm not directly affecting the organs themselves. I'm indirectly increasing energy and circulation to those areas to help those organs heal themselves and function better. If you have any questions, feel free to come see me at Strength in You. Stay tuned for our next video where we'll talk about the lower back reflexes and the rest of the organs. I'm Crystal from Strength in You, and remember, you're only one strategy away from crushing your fitness goals.